Are there, are there real differences in men and women when it comes to heart disease? Um, traditionally, uh, we have all thought that heart disease has been a man's disease and women's disease um, was kind of put on the back burner. Um, each year, more women die from cardiovascular disease uh, than any other forms of cancer. For every woman that dies from breast cancer, you have six women that die from cardiac disease. Currently, there are over eight million American women who have been diagnosed with heart disease. And the question is, how many of those women die from heart disease? So I think we all need to ask ourselves, well, you know, why me and why now? Um, women have been traditionally thought to be protected from heart disease because of the natural estrogen that they have. And as you reach perimenopause and menopause in your early 40s and throughout your six, through the 60s, your levels of estrogen decline and your risk of developing heart disease rapidly catches up with men. Okay? So that protection that you've had during your early years, it kind of evaporates rather quickly within one decade. Okay? And the traditional risk factors that we've associated for men still hold true for women. Uh, smoking, high blood pressure, high uh, blood cholesterol, uh, over, being overweight, uh, obese, physical inactivity, diabetes, family history of early heart disease, and for women uh, being age 50 or older, and of course men being age 45 or older. So it's been um, a misperception, uh, especially from doctors. Um, and sometimes women's chest pain symptoms um, may be thought of you know, as a GI symptom, as uh, hyperventilation sy you know, syndrome um, that's related to anxiety. And so we have some uh, medical reasons from doctors where uh, women have been misdiagnosed. Another arm is uh, clinical research. Uh, the vast majority of research done on heart disease have been performed on men. Um, and so uh, up until just recently, uh, women have not been included to a large extent in clinical trials looking at heart disease. This problem of heart disease is a large um, pervasive problem. 2.5 million women per year in the US are hospitalized with cardiovascular disease. And from that, over 500,000 women die from cardiovascular disease. And the leading cause of death in women is coronary artery disease. Um, 200, over 230,000 women die from coronary artery disease. And when I say uh, cardiovascular versus coronary artery, cardiovascular means stroke and heart and peripheral vascular disease, okay? So these are the perceptions um, this is a Gallup poll survey back in 1995. Um, on the left side, you see a graph of what women think um, are health threats, and on the right side are the real health threats. So you can see 55% of the women polled thought that cancer or breast cancer specifically was the greatest threat to their life, and heart attacks was 2%, okay? But the reality is, is that 46% of women actually have the greatest risk, and cancer is 24%. Thank you very much.